In the second portion of this video, we're going to talk about rounding to other place values. On this slide, we're going to be rounding to the hundredths place, which is one place to the right of the tenths place. You may have seen these problems before. They are in your math journal, so go ahead and save your work and you can transfer the correct answers to your journal. When rounding to any place, we can always use the same rule, 1 through 4, shut the door, 5 through 9, climb the vine. So here we have some times in seconds, and it wants us to round to the tenths, hundredths place. So just like we did in the tenths place, we're going to underline the hundredths place because that's what we want to round to. We want to round to the hundredths place. And just like we did before, we're going to look at the number to the right of the hundredths place. So looking at this 2, it is less than 5, or it is in this 1 through 4, so we're going to shut the door. So this is going to look like 10 and 75 hundredths of a second. Looking at the next one, the number to the right of the underlined place, or the number to the right of the hundredths place is a 1. That fits in the 1 through 4, so we're going to shut the door or leave that 9 how it is. So this answer is going to be 11 and 91 hundredths of a second. Looking at our last one, the underlined hundredths place is a 1 and to the right of that is a 5. That fits under the rule 5 through 9, climb the vine. So we're going to increase the underlined number by 1. So our answer is 10 and 82 hundredths of a second. Looking over here, it really doesn't make sense to say you're going to give someone 28 dollars and 374 cents. When we say money, we're always rounding to the hundredths place. So again, I'm going to underline the hundredths place. Looking at the numbers to the right of the hundredths place, we have a 4. That fits in our rule 1 through 4, shut the door. So this is going to be 28 dollars and 37 cents. Looking at this next problem, the underlined hundredths place is a 1. To the right of the 1 is a 6. That fits in our 5 through 9, climb the vine. So our answer is going to be $16. And climbing that vine, we're going to change the 1 to a 2, 92 cents. Last problem, we have a 9 to the right of the hundredths place, which fits in the rule to climb the vine. So we have $18 and 47 because we're increasing the underlying number by 1. We're going to do some random rounding. So these questions are going to have us round lots of different things to different place values. So we're just going to keep using our rule and underlining where they want us to round. 16.4 to the nearest whole number. All that means is we don't want a decimal. We want the nearest whole number. So looking at this 4, it fits in the rule 1 through 4, shut the door. So we are going to just leave this as 16. We're just going to leave it because 4 fits under the rule 1 through 4, shut the door. Okay, rounding to the nearest tenth place. Tenth is the place we want to round to, so that's the number we underline. 3 is in the tenth place, tenths place. Looking at the number to the right of the 3, where does that fit into? It fits our rule 5 through 9, climb the vine. So we are going to increase the 3 by 1. So we have 7.4 and everything after turns to zeros or you can just leave it blank. Okay, 9,282 to the nearest hundred. So we're going to underline the hundreds place. If we sing our songs, sing our place value song, it goes ones, tens, hundreds, comma. So this is our hundreds place. Looking to the right of the hundreds place, we have an eight. That fits our rule, five through nine, climb the vine. So we're going to increase the two by one. So 9,300 because everything after that number turns to a zero. Okay, 30.08 to the nearest tenth. Again, that tenths place is right after the decimal. Looking at the number to the right of the tenths place, we are going to climb the vine. So we have 30 and 1 tenth. 482 to the nearest hundred. So let's underline the hundreds place. Ones, tens, hundreds. Looking at the number to the right of that underlined number, we have an eight. So we're climbing the vine. That four is turning to a five. And everything else that follows is a zero. 
And lastly, we're rounding to the nearest hundred thousand. Let's sing our song. Ones, tens, hundreds, comma, thousands, ten thousands, hundred thousands. So we're going to underline that four. To the right of our four, we're looking there. That is a two, fits our rule, one through four, shut the door. So we're going to leave that a four, and everything after is going to turn to zeros. So our answer is 400,000.